I've got so much that I want to say. Dear Alicia, it's amazing how one night can change the direction of our lives. After that amazing night, I couldn't stop thinking about you. We became inseparable and set in motion our beautiful life together. Ian, I can't wait to marry my high school sweetheart. I'm so lucky to have found you at such a young age to live the best life with you. I wish I could go back and show our 17-year-old selves this exact moment. You played so many roles in my life since then. Boyfriend, prom date, dog dad, baby daddy, fiance, and now I can't wait to fall even in more love with you as your new role, my husband. The love you showed for me during those high school days proved to me that you would do anything for us to be together. You are the most caring person I know and the best mom to our kids I could have ever imagined. Thank you for everything you constantly do for our family. We're so proud of you for everything you set your mind to, to achieve. You're the best dad and I love seeing our babies all adore you more than I can ever imagine. I think Dory and Finding Nemo said it best, when I look at you, I feel it, I'm home. I can't wait to officially call you my wife. I love you so incredibly much, love Ian. Thank you for me and my rock and my best friend for life. I love you so much, my husband, love Alicia. What dreams are made of, I thought happy endings. Alicia, you have the ability to make everyone feel loved, appreciated, and taken care of. You had the qualities of a mother long before you ever became one, and that is something about you I have always admired. I am confident that everyone here would agree that they feel important because of the love that you give, and I have no doubt Ian has always felt that from you too. Ian, you are the happiest, most easygoing guy I know. You can talk to anybody, and just like Alicia, you make everyone feel welcome. And I could not imagine a more perfect person for me to share my best friend with. I can't explain I thought happy endings Was something made up Just for the movies What dreams are made of During your time together, you've been building the foundation for your marriage. And today you cross over a line and join hands in a sacred tradition that declares your intention to remain committed to each other for the rest of your lives. There are no obligations on earth more sweet or tender than those you are about to assume. There are no vows more solemn than those you are about to make. There is no human institution more sacred than the covenant of marriage. Today, your separate lives with their individual memories, desires, and hopes merge into one. And as you travel through life together, I urge you to remember that the true measure of success, the true avenue of joy and peace, is to be found within the love you hold in your hearts. Your marriage will be your safe haven, a place where you can be yourselves and talk about anything and everything, a place to share your joys and sorrows. And even though marriage brings challenges and needs to be constantly worked on, we always know that being together in love is the greatest happiness that life can bring. I, Ian, take you, Alicia, as my friend and partner for life. I, Alicia, take you, Ian, as my friend and partner for life. I promise to love you unconditionally. To respect and support you. To laugh with you and cry with you. To be patient with you. To inspire you. Through growth and change. In good times and bad. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. By the power vested in me by the Commonwealth of Massachusetts, but primarily by the power of your love for each other, I now pronounce you husband and wife. <laughs> <laughs>a scarce amount of people in their life get to call people their friends or even their best friends but there are 
few people who reach a truly new level, which I would describe as true brotherhood. And after knowing you for over 20 years, Ian, I thank you for your friendship, and I'm internally grateful and even blessed to call you my brother. Alicia, you're one of the strongest women that I know. Behind every great man is always a stronger woman. You guys complement each other so well. You've been a perfect model for a relationship. Um, not always agreeing, but always on the same page. And if you're not always on the same page, at least in the same book. Many years of wanting to have someone as wonderful as my daughter. To me, such a wonderful, wonderful guy. I love him. He treats my daughter like gold. He's a great father to my grandkids. I could only wish them the most happiness in the world. And I love you guys. God bless you. Feels like